with a new video for you guys and today's video is going to be another Q&A video because I did one a while ago and I haven't done any more and I decided it would be fun to do another one and I'm sorry for the humming noise in the background I have my fan on I sent a tweet that was saying um, hashtag ask Madden's girl and if you guys saw it some people sent me some questions and I'm going to be answering them now so thank you to everybody who asked me questions be sure to be following me on my social media they are both Madden's girl 05 to be sure you know what I'm doing in the next Q&A but yeah um, also guys I'm currently wearing charger colors as you guys can tell because supporting San Diego um yeah so anyways guys I guess let's just get started with the Q&A Okay, so I have my phone right here, and I'm just going to be reading off all the questions I got. So the first question I got was from at SteelerBarbie05, and she asked me, How do you get your eyebrows to be so on fleek? Um, I... Well, thank you. My eyebrows are actually not on fleek right now. They are very, very... Like, I have to pluck them. But I actually have never gotten my eyebrows professionally done. I have always done it myself. One day, I just, like... My eyebrows used to be, like, this thick, and I used to have a unibrow pretty much. Yeah, um, and then one day I just kind of plucked it all and it just ended up like this and I've kept them the same shape and I actually like them like this and I recently started filling them in so they look a little bit different and I like them like this so I just pluck them and fill them in occasionally so that is that at alleycat1417 underscore she asked me if you could dye your hair one color for just one day what color would you choose one day I think I would dye my hair pastel pink because I think that is absolutely gorgeous any pastel colors in your hair and I wanted to know what I look like with pastel pink hair at beauty guru Gaines asked me what is your lock screen um, my lock screen is a picture of the One Direction concert and this is the um, arena I took a picture of the arena when it was like little things and it was so pretty because of the lights and stuff like that so that was what my lock screen is and here is just a close-up of what it looks like. It was really, really pretty, and that is my lock screen. The next question is from at it's jazzy76, um, and she asked me, how much do you love McDonald's? And I love McDonald's this much. At Guru Shoutouts asked me, fave Disney movie. Um, I love Disney movies, um, so it's very, very hard for me to choose a favorite. I actually thought about this for a long time, and I have to go with either High School Musical or any of the Disney Princess movies. I am obsessed with Disney Princesses, so I cannot actually choose one. Maybe Cinderella, or Sleeping Beauty, or Aladdin, or I don't even know because I love all the Disney Princess movies. Radical Madcon underscore asked me, what do you say you smell like? Um, well, I smell, I smell like my perfume. It's like a sweet candy smell and I smell like sugar right now because why not? But I smell like sugar right now. Usually I smell like sweat though, so... Tips by Megan asked me, favorite international food? Um, that has to probably be... After thinking about this for a long time, I finally came to the conclusion of Chinese food because I love getting some Chinese food. Chinese food is very, very good. I love having, like, karaoke chicken or orange chicken or chow mein. I love Chinese food. I need to do underscore ask me, how tall are you? And I'm actually a giant. I am 5'7 or 5... I'm like between 5'6 to 5'8. I don't remember how tall I am. I think I'm 5'7. Um, but I am very, very tall because my dad's like 6'3, so he's a giant too. Um, so I get that from him, and now I am very, very tall. So I'm 5'7. At XO Beauty Bay XO asks me. Do you have a celebrity crush? If so, who? And yes, I have many, 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 many celebrity crushes. Um, just a few of them would probably be Harry Styles, Louis Tomlinson, Niall Horan, <laughs> Zayn Malik, um, Liam Payne, Dylan O'Brien, and the list just goes on and on and on. At Rosie G99 asked me, how do you feel about this? This is a picture. It's a picture of Harry, and he looks like a freaking god right here. Oh my goodness. But as to how I feel about this picture, words do not really describe how I feel, only emotions, and I can't really explain how I feel, except for, um, that's my new, um, background on my phone, because, beautiful. At underscore Nary's Kingdom asked me, what's the 100th picture on your camera roll? Random, but a hey, okay, that is a random question, I will see right now, let me go counting my pictures, because I have a lot of pictures. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, three, fifty, four, fifty, five, fifty, six, seven, ninety, eight, ninety, nine, a hundred. Okay, the picture that is my one hundredth picture is a picture from my friend Rhiannon's birthday party, and we were all covered in like foam because we did um. Twister, but you put like you know shaving cream on the thing so we were all covered in foam and we were about to jump into the pool This is a picture. I think this is me right here But this is our picture and we are covered in like foam and stuff So that is that you guys are honestly killing me right now. These questions are so hard The next question is from Emily Netlows Nguyen. I always pronounce your name wrong, so I'm sorry, Emily, if I did that again. Thoughts on me, as in her. My thoughts on Emily is that you are flawless, and you are amazing, and you are really funny, and I love having English class with you because you are perfect. Next question comes from at Livy Love 17 She asked me, favorite thing about being on YouTube? Um, my favorite thing about being on YouTube is being able to show people like what I love to do and just like doing something that I like to do and also meeting new people and making friends and just like making like a difference maybe on people's lives. Not that I did, but hopefully I made a difference in somebody's life and just kind of like having fun. And then meeting new people, that's a big thing for me. I love meeting new people, so I love this about YouTube and also I can be like social but not social you know and then the final question I'm answering is from at Gabe J Romero and he asked me do you know today's homework honestly but you know you're thirsty when you have a water bottle three times the size of you uh, yeah, so anyways guys, I hope you guys liked my Q&A video, and if you guys did, be sure to give it a thumbs up, and also follow me on my social media site, so then you can know when there's a new um, Q&A going to be uploaded and stuff like that, and yeah, also I hope you guys have a good day, and I love you guys to the moon and back, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!